Everyone wants to know if you actually shaved your head and if you really <laughs> use a flipper. So I know the answers to both of those questions. So instead, <laughs> What was it like doing the, the bald cap process? And then what was required VFX wise in order to do the flipper part? Okay, so the bald cap was one of the coolest things I've ever done. I was walking around and I was like, I'm gonna shave my head. If they wanted me to shave my head for season two for the whole time, I would, I would do it. It was so cool. A long time in hair and makeup. They actually flew me to Sydney, which is where I'm from, which was great. So I got to say hi to mom and dad, but they flew me to Sydney to do, um, like a cast over my head. I actually have a photo of it on my Instagram. And that's something that was really hard for me because it's kind of claustrophobic. You're completely covered in like this silicon sort of, I don't even know what it is that creates a mold of your entire like head to chest. And you're in there for like 20 minutes, like trying to breathe through like these tiny little holes, which was hard, but it was, it was fun. It was a lot of fun. They were so good at their job, the people that worked there. So it was great. Then they made a bald cap from that shape of my head and then added each individual hair onto it. Like every single hair on there was like put in one by one. Amazing. So like, wow. Um, then when we were doing it, I was in hair and makeup for like four and a half, five hours, getting it on, um, then blending it in with my skin. I wasn't able to like eat breakfast or anything because you can't chew with the, with the, yeah, with it on. So it was, it was hard, but it was so much fun. I just loved walking around in it. Um, it was great. And the teeth, the flipper was like, they just, when they just put two little dots on my teeth through the camera, like not on my actual teeth and just in post edit them out, which is amazing. Cause even when I'm moving and talking, they were just like going shot by shot, frame by frame and removing those teeth, which is really cool. And then I had a, um, flipper that had the teeth on it and then a flipper that didn't have the teeth on it so I had something to click in and something to click out but they were two different things so every time I was like okay we have to have the flipper in this shot because she's already taken it out so I have the one with the teeth on it and they cut and then I have to put the one with the with no teeth on it so I can click it in because I actually have teeth there so I couldn't click in a proper one so it was very like kind of stop starting but by the end of season one we everyone was so used to the process and they were like okay and we were all like pros at it and we just knew exactly what to do but at the beginning, it was like, wait, very confusing.